passé par là, ça va plus loin. C'est sûr ouais, Gotten married? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, you want me to renew your vows for you? Yeah, mama? yeah, we can do it here. <laughs> Bienvenue, welcome to the carnival. Bienvenue on the Vigital Herb. Before the development of the Ada Vicenia, it was a salt flat, and before the salt flat, it was a big uh, mangrove forest with Varizophora trees, maybe 100 years ago. And 20 years ago, it was a salt flat without any, any trees because of the high salinity of the environment. Zero, do, do we know how long this feature? In the, in the shape of the heart has actually been here. This shape, uh, the oldest picture, the oldest iron Eternity. picture we have, <laughs> it's uh, in 1942. 1942. Uh, the US but Army this did some picture. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it was this stuff. The US yeah. Army did some yeah, picture yeah. in uh, 1942, so we, we know that since this date, the shape was existing here. Yeah. Uh, the local people would have the chance to climb up the hill and see it. Yes. Um, even exactly. before the planes actually came yeah. until, 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 yeah. until it would take on a, yeah. a significance, broader significance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> would, uh, yeah. Would, Something yeah. like that would have a, oh, I don't, I don't know, the whether the heart shape so. actually meant anything oh, yeah. in yeah. the past. Yeah. 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 <laughs> exactly. That's a good yeah. point. Yeah. But Jack did a, did a path um, on the hill yeah. at 400 meters and 700 meters and you can have a very nice view of the hut from the hill. Mm. Mm.
Abyssinia has occupied and filled the hut all the way completely. No other vegetation. It seems to be an algal surface layer, but apart from that, it's a story of of infill of Abyssinia marina. Photos from the 80s, we can see that the hut was opened. Um, but we know from those old aerial photographs that it was full before with Abyssinia. Right. So, amazingly versatile plant. In North Queensland, you'd be going to Cereops or uh -huh. some other species, you know, like, right. yeah. whether you've got, where well, you don't have much. Yeah, yeah. I guess so a low tide. Cereops here. Yeah. A low tide. We'd see the soil surface would be drained, yeah. right? Yeah, because it's high. It it's is. high tide and it's one of the highest tide of the year. Ah, okay. Feels good. Only the genus is mm -hmm. kind of stable. Come on, Rhizophora. Oh, in here, yeah. before in the salt here. flat. Okay. Mm -hmm. Some Rhizophora stems. And uh, sediment, sediment. Yeah. After uh, Avicenia. Yes, there's no sand here. <laughs> there's definitely no sand. Yeah, we. <laughs> But if, if you go in the middle of the earth, maybe you'll find more sand. More sand, sand there. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. And, and, and quite a bit of organic. Rhizophora and the Avicenia and a lot, lots yes. of organic matter of, from Rhizophora decomposing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so here is very yeah, that's what I feel here. So I don't okay. even feel silt or clay. No, no, here yeah. it's very, it's very organic. What do you think the organic matter we get content this, this is? It's really this. typical it, for like. Oh, I see, I see very fine roots. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh huh. Probably the organic content is about. Um, 